I think so. for me, one thing that I really like about this particular matchup, because I play both characters and I've been on both sides of the coin, is the fact that really, like, you already know, obviously, Captain Falcon, you know, can handle Cloud off stage. That Cloud's recovery can be pretty vulnerable, but the same can be said, too, when that man throws out that Nair edge guard and Captain Falcon, man, at the very least, he can put on a ton of damage. So we'll see how it'll fare for show. We got game number one. We got town and city. Let's get it on. That's right. And already we see right here. Just dashing around Young Savage, not trying to get caught by these arrows by Cloud, but the quick interception with that cross slash, man, giving so much damage. And I like that little delay, too, that you saw from Paco, right? He's trying to see if he can maybe catch an early double jump, but has to watch out for them commitments right there on the jabs, right? Absolutely. It's a bit of a mix-up, though. It's still early. He doesn't get a big punish off of it. Mm, but, okay. oh, okay, okay, Young Savage. That's a surprise option. You know, it'll just catch you for it, throw you for a loop sometimes. The, you don't see it coming. The fact that everybody is throwing out some pretty unsafe options early is already good conditioning that's happening right here. Okay, trying to see if he can get that re-grab off of there, but, I mean, it was, was it still a good tech chase situation going on? Where's the ledge traps? Okay. Okay, Paco. I like that. What? Right. Kind of handling business. Look at that. Oh, okay. The up tilt coming out rather quickly, too. Couldn't even quite react to it. The only thing we saw was the fact that he got hit. You know what I'm saying? Okay, has the limit. Tries oh, to get the wow, hit. Okay. And you know what? There it is. <laughs> so he just threw that out there. And honestly, Young Savage just kind of gave him that stock. Just ran right into it. Because in this situation, he didn't have to approach. Yeah, I think what happened there is Couldn't maybe... Put the pump the brakes fast he enough. Pro he probably, probably had a, a game plan and executed w even mm. regardless of what was happening in front of them. Because sometimes that happens, right? Where you're playing and you want to do something, you have a game plan going on, and all of a sudden your opponent's like, nope, I predicted yeah. that you're going to dash it. But here it is. Right now with the lead is Paco. Ch has the full limit on deck now and trying to see if he can keep it safe. But the jabs from Young Savage forcing this cloud um, to just get, get off stage. You know, in this particular situation, we want to see the limit get burnt. That way it can be easier for Young Savage to get the stock, but... Uh-oh, it's kind of hard now. It really is, and that's where it's such a big responsibility for on his part, really. When you get him off stage, you have to capitalize on that. Make sure he has to burn that limit and not get an opportunity like that to just swing it so wildly, just aiming for that stock. Not going to get it, though. However, the pressure on the part of Paco continues, my lord. Yep, and I loved what you saw right there, right? The F-tilt. He wasn't trying to get... Uh-oh, never mind. There's an opening, and Paco in a good position. Okay, I thought we were oh. going to see a reverse in there instead. <laughs> Adios. Yes, such perfect timing with the back air. Getting rid of that stock in a timely fashion. No stocks gone with Paco taking the first game here in the singles set that we, the first single set that we get to watch here on stream on Arrival Tournaments. By the way, guys, if you're loving the action that you're seeing from the guys out on Arrival Tournaments, drop a follow. And if you're, you know, feeling charitable, drop, feel free to drop a sub as well. You know, it goes a long way. You might even have a Twitch Prime sub you don't even know about, man. Link that account, show some support to one of Easy. the best streamers in the business. We definitely that's, appreciate that's everything right, they man. do. That's right. Here it is. Okay, so Paco again. You know, uh, from that first one that he had, it looks like he's rather comfortable going into this. You know, no, no wow, okay. Yes. Trying to see if he can get that cross slash confirmation, but with the opponent being so high in the sky, he kind of was able to pop out. Oh my goodness, I love the movement right now that we're really seeing from Paco. Just such a smooth operator is honestly what it kind of comes down to. Falcon here, Young Savage just hasn't really had too many opportunities to get his offense rolling, and that certainly continues to be the trend. What a footstool. Paco and me. Oh my goodness. He's kind of almost eviscerating this first stock D1. Yep, and right there, the Falcon Kick just immediately with the interception. You know, another option that, uh, just like I was talking about before, can just catch opponents off guard. Right. Okay. <gasps> okay, he wanted to see if he could get that empty jump grab. And with all of those short hop up airs, you can totally. Woo! Woo! What the hell kind I mean, of option? I mean, it's good. It has invincibility. Right, if you're opponent. Yeah, right? Then just think about the Meta Knights back in the day in Brawl, right? Where. You expect your opponent to try to jump at you and do something, so you just shuttle loop. You're right. Throw, throw you're back. right. Bro, you're right. Yeah, he tried to get the footstool down there. I see you, Paco. He, he's technically sound. Oh, yeah. Paco is very nice. I like the, just the fluidity that this cloud plays with, man. Yeah. You can tell very seasoned, man. Been through some battles for sure. And Young Savage, well, he's just becoming another war scar. Yeah. <laughs> That's what's pretty much happening. <gasps> see ya. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> You can count two to 100. Stock, double two stock right there. Sorry about that, guys. A little bit of a cough. Might have breathed some dust in. But right there, unfortunately, Young Savage biting it, the dust that is, yeah. um, with a double two stock loss to Paco, who, just like I said before, you know, when it comes to this particular matchup, it can be difficult. But at the same time, it can be done. There are some t tools that Captain Falcon has, but you have to be... You have to show respect to 